There are two choices ahead of us. We can either return to a status quo that's destroying the planet for the sake of a wealthy few, or we can leverage this crisis to build a world that works for all of us. To do so, we, alongside thousands of groups around the world, are calling for a just recovery that puts people before profit. So how are we going to do it? The only way we are going to win a just recovery is by building a mass, people-powered movement that will fight for it. We are going to need to organize through three distinct phases. First, there's the response. This is the phase that most of us are in right now. Here, we're responding to the crisis and making sure that people have what they need both through mutual aid efforts and by demanding increased government action. We're also standing up to oil and gas lobbyists and multi-billion dollar corporations demanding massive bailouts. Soon, we'll move into the recovery phase. This is when governments will start to reopen the economy and attempt to return us to a normal that has always been deadly and destructive. During this period, a small corporate elite will be circling like vultures to make billions off the crisis. They'll sacrifice workers and communities in the name of profit and pressure all levels of government in hopes of lining their pockets with stimulus funding that should be going to everyday people. For us, this is a key phase in the fight for a just recovery. This is the phase where we fight for government action to meet our community's needs instead. This will lead us into the rebuilding phase. As social distancing is lifted, the wealthy elite and the politicians that serve them will try and claim that we've spent too much over the past months and that we must cut, roll back, and privatize critical public services. For us, this is the time to win the transformative change we need, rebuilding through a Made in Canada Green New Deal that respects Indigenous rights, creates millions of good jobs, and finally, enshrines dignity and justice for all. If we can bring together enough of our neighbors and friends and convince them to talk to their neighbors and friends about why we need a just recovery, we can get the ball rolling. Then, we'll take action together, likely starting online, but then moving into the streets to put direct pressure on those in power. Because let's face it, we all have something to lose because of the climate crisis, and we've all been impacted by coronavirus in some way. Every single one of us has something to fight for right now. And if enough of us come together, we can win a Green New Deal and finally begin building a world that works for all of us, and not just the wealthy few.